Dear boys and girls, Once upon a time in the land of Politicsville, there were these creatures called politicians. Picture them in colorful suits, waving their hands, and promising the moon. Now, the history of politics is a bit like a roller coaster, lots of ups and downs, twists, and turns. So, back in the ancient times, not really, just a few centuries ago, people started gathering in groups and decided, hey, let's figure out how to run things together. And thus, politics was born, a bit like a committee meeting, but with more drama. There were kings and queens who ruled with iron fists, and everyone had to do the royal cha-cha. But then, some folks got fed up and said, we want to say in this whole ruling thing. And voila, democracy was born, where everyone gets a chance to pick the leader, like a giant game of musical chairs. Of course, there were wars, power struggles, and the occasional scandal. Politicians became the rock stars of the political stage, with their speeches and debates that sometimes felt like stand-up comedy shows. They even had their version of knock-knock jokes, you know, the ones where they promise lower taxes, more jobs, and free ice cream for everyone. Now, let's not forget the inventions that changed political games. The printing press made pamphlets and posters, spreading political gossip faster than a rumor in a small town. And then came TV, oh boy, did that revolutionize everything. Suddenly, politicians had to worry about their hair, makeup, and the perfect smile. It was like a political beauty pageant. As time marched on, social media entered the scene. Politicians learned to tweet, post selfies, and engage in epic comment wars. It was the era of viral politics, where a catchy slogan or a funny meme could win more hearts than a well-rehearsed speech. And so, dear boys and girls, that's a brief history of how we got here. Politics, where every day is a new episode of a sitcom and the scriptwriters are all of us. Remember, in Politicsville, laughter might just be the best policy.